My name is Lynn Conway and I'm the archivist for Georgetown University. Today I'm going to share and provide context for an item from our collections. This is a campus map showing four possible sites being considered for a new library in the 1940s. A new library was needed because Riggs Library, which had opened in Healy Hall in 1891, had run out of space for its collections. According to a note at the top, the four sites uh, shown on the map are numbered in order of the preference of Father Lawrence Gorman, who was Georgetown University president in the 1940s. Site three behind Dalgan Chapel was very quickly removed from consideration because it was considered as too close to New North, which at that time was a dorm. And by the time the university was actually ready to move forward with building a library, Site four north of Copley Hall had been used to build the Rice Science Building. Likewise, site two outside the main gates was unavailable by the time the university was ready to build. Uh, it had been removed from consideration for zoning uh, issues. Uh, although as the note at the bottom, which is written by Father Bill Repete, who became university archivist in 1946 shows, there were always, uh, issues with using the site, the note indicates that building there would involve considerable expense because it would require the purchase of seven houses. So that left site number one, always the preferred location on the corner of 37th and Prospect Street, where Laringer Library began being built in 1967. 